Hello, in this video I will show you how to implement GANS module into Base Dynamic Combat System. And this is Unreal Engine 5.2. And on the left side I have Base Dynamic Combat System with Mel weapons. And on the right side this is uh, DCS with GANS. Okay, so first thing we need to do is to copy this whole GANS module folder into our Base Dynamic Combat System. So let's open it in Explorer and let's simply copy it and paste it in here. And this will give us access to all files that are, that are required by the GANS module. And now we need to update a couple of functions and animations across a few blueprints. So let's start with animation blueprint used by combat character, which is player and AI. Okay, and in here we need to update uh, some of animation layers. So let's copy those graphs into this blueprint. Okay, and we need to connect it rifle with rifle pose and pistol with this one. Now let's update aiming. And here we need to do exactly the same thing. Okay, and GANS Park is also using unique animations for jumping, so we need to update them as well. So let's start with land. Here you can find uh, those custom animations. Okay, now let's go to jump start. Let's do the same. And we're falling. Okay, and that's all we had to do in animation blueprint. So now let's move to uh, BP combat character, which is blueprint used by the player. And here we need to copy this whole guns event graph. So let's copy it and paste it in here. And at this point, uh, we won't need guns uh, pack anymore so let's maximize this one and let's also let's on only update this one so if i press compile uh, i'm getting a bunch of errors and to fix them i need to press file and refresh all nodes and then all errors are gone so next thing we need to do is to find uh, type in let's type in gun update uh, under find result and if you don't have it if you don't have this tab you can find it under window and find results okay now we, we need to go through all the comments and call the proper functions based on common common text so for example here we have to copy reset gun input Okay, in these functions we have to specify what montages will be used based on current combat style of player. So for example, when uh, we're in pistol combat style, we have to use player pistol montages. And let's do the same for rifle and shotgun. Okay, let's move on to next uh, function calls. Okay, and that's all we have to do. Uh, now we let's move on to equipment and inventory components. So under equipment component, we need to add another main hand type, 
which is ranged weapon. This will allow us to switch between melee weapon such as sword or axe into a gun, such like uh, rifle or pistol. And now let's also add a couple of items to inventory component, so we can test them. Okay, and we need to add ammo as well. Okay, now that I've played the game, I should already be able to equip um, rifle and pistol, and I can switch to them but we don't have any visual representation uh, of what gun is currently equipped so we can fix that under um, widget blueprint slots uh, here we have this range weapon slot which by default is hidden so let's change its uh, visibility okay, and we can position them as you wish now if I play the game I can see uh, what weapon is currently equipped and I can switch between them So yeah, so basically that's all we had to do to match these packs. We can also test if AI is, is working, so let's drag and drop a few of them. Okay, so that's all I wanted to show you in this video. Thanks for watching.